Have you ever imagined a solar system where every planet is an Earth? Picture this, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and even Pluto, each spinning on their own axis with a version of humanity calling them home. Each planet with its unique characteristics hosting its own interpretation of life as we know it. Imagine the quicksilver days and nights on Mercury, the aerial lifestyles on Venus, the frontier spirit on Mars. Picture Jupiter, a world of heightened physical forces, Saturn with its sky full of rings, Uranus with its extreme seasons, and Neptune, a vast ocean world. And finally, Pluto, the distant outpost for the hardiest explorers amongst us. This is not just a flight of fancy, but a thought experiment that challenges our understanding of life, culture, and interplanetary dynamics. So buckle up and let your imagination take flight. Join us on this journey across a reimagined solar system. First stop, Mercury, the swift planet where a year lasts just 88 Earth days. Imagine this world, the closest to the Sun, where time seems to fly. With such a rapid orbit, the concept of a year could be drastically different to what we know. Their civilizations might see time as a fleeting commodity with the hustle and bustle of life moving at a faster pace. But it's not just time that's extreme on Mercury. With scorching days and freezing nights, the temperature variations are nothing short of dramatic. This would require the inhabitants to create advanced technology capable of creating habitable zones. Picture a society constantly innovating, constantly adapting, where every day brings a new challenge and a new solution. This is the speedy world of Mercury, a place of extremes of rapid change and ceaseless innovation. On to the next planet, our cloud-shrouded twin, Venus. Venus, our sister planet, yet drastically different. Often dubbed Earth's twin, Venus is similar in size and mass, yet its environment is wildly dissimilar. Imagine a world shrouded in a thick, unyielding atmosphere, the surface temperature hot enough to melt lead. Now imagine humanity thriving here. How, you ask? Think above and beyond, quite literally. Floating cities hovering in the cooler, upper layers of the atmosphere could be the answer. These aerial metropolises would offer respite from the scorching surface, providing a unique perspective of the planet's swirling, cloud-covered landscapes. Life here would be a study in adaptation. Residents would lead skybound lifestyles, perhaps developing new forms of transportation and communication tailored to their lofty homes. They would rely heavily on advanced technology to maintain these floating sanctuaries mastering the art of living high above a hostile world. Now let's travel to the red frontier, Mars. Red. Mars, our neighboring red planet, a frontier world. Imagine Mars not as a barren desert, but as a thriving Earth-like planet. This world with its vast deserts and towering volcanoes presents a unique environment for life. The Mars dwellers, let's call them Martians, might be pioneers in terraforming. Transforming the iron-rich red dust into fertile soil could become second nature to them. With the discovery of subterranean water on Mars, these Martians could tap into these hidden reserves to support agriculture and sustain life. The thin atmosphere, though challenging, might inspire innovative solutions for creating breathable air. Living on Mars would require resilience and adaptability, qualities that have defined humanity throughout our history. The Martians would be a testament to human ingenuity, turning a once inhospitable planet into a new home. This red frontier, a symbol of human determination and the endless possibilities that lie within our reach. Our next destination is the gas giant Jupiter. Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system, a true challenge for our imagination. Traditionally, a gas giant, we're envisioning a Jupiter that has miraculously evolved to possess a solid surface. The sheer size of this planet means that its gravity would be significantly greater than Earth's. This would result in a world where physical forces are amplified and the inhabitants would need to be incredibly strong to survive. These hypothetical humans would likely evolve to withstand the extreme gravitational pull resulting in a society of strong, robust beings. The atmospheric conditions on this new Jupiter would also be fascinating, with storms that dwarf those on Earth and a constant swirling cloud cover that creates an ever-changing skyscape. Life here would be shaped by these powerful environmental forces leading to unique adaptations and innovative survival strategies. Next, we venture to the ringed haven Saturn. Saturn, the jewel of our solar system, a place of celestial beauty. This gas giant, if transformed into an Earth-like world, would offer a stunning sky filled with its signature rings. 
painting a breathtaking canvas for its inhabitants. This spectacle would likely shape a society deeply fascinated by the cosmos, nurturing a culture rich in astronomy and space navigation. But the uniqueness of Saturn doesn't stop at its rings. Its potential Earth-like moons, such as Titan and Enceladus, could add another layer of complexity to this society. These moons might host their own distinct civilizations, fostering a robust system of intermoon travel and trade. Imagine the exchange of ideas, the shared knowledge, the collective progress that could stem from this celestial interconnectivity. Saturn, in this imagined scenario, emerges as a haven, a ringed sanctuary where the beauty of the cosmos intertwines with the daily life of its inhabitants. Now let's move on to the tilted planet Uranus. Uranus, the planet with a unique tilt, a world of extreme seasons. Here we delve into the peculiarities of a planet that spins on its side with an axis tilt of over 90 degrees. This unusual orientation results in drastic seasonal variations, making the Uranian year a roller coaster of climatic changes. Imagine an Earth like Uranus, where its human inhabitants have adapted to these extreme conditions. They would experience a world where the sun rises in the north and sets in the south, a stark contrast to our earthly experience. The long Uranian year equivalent to 84 Earth years would mean each season lasts for over 20 years. This could potentially lead to a nomadic lifestyle with communities continually migrating to follow the shifting habitable zones. It would be a world where adaptability is not just a trait, but a way of life a testament to the resilience of humanity even in the most extreme environments. Our penultimate stop is the ocean world, Neptune. Neptune, the farthest giant, a planet of deep blue oceans. In this reimagined universe, Neptune would be an endless expanse of water, a boundless ocean world. Imagine humanity adapting to such a landscape where land is a concept as alien as the deepest sea trenches on our current Earth. Living conditions here would be unlike anything we know. Imagine cities floating on the surface, bobbing gently with the ocean waves, or perhaps even submerged cities nestled in the ocean depths, shielded from the harsh cosmic elements. The culture here might be deeply intertwined with the sea, with every aspect of life revolving around the ocean, from food sources to transportation, from recreation to industry. The inhabitants might become masters of marine biology, exploring the depths of their ocean world and harnessing its abundant resources. Finally, we reach the edge of our solar system, the distant outpost, Pluto. Pluto, the dwarf planet at the edge of our solar system, a place for the hardiest of explorers. Despite not holding official planetary status, let's envision it as Earth's distant outpost. In the icy vastness, humans would need to display extraordinary resilience, braving extreme cold and isolation. Yet such a frontier might foster an unparalleled spirit of discovery, pushing the boundaries of human reach. In this grand tour of our reimagined solar system, we've explored how humanity might adapt to life on each planet.